Can you see it in the darkness? It's an advent calendar. I have made so many advent calendars this year. I've got some. The house is currently in. You can't see. It's in bits. <laughs> it's all my furniture in the living room. Um, but amongst the bits and pieces, it's full of advent calendars. There's another one over here, somewhere, somewhere in amongst the chaos down here. Um, in that bag, that bag over there, it's another advent calendar. I'm making these mostly for grown-ups. Um, I'm also making them for the village. That uh, my mum and I rigged this afternoon because most of my work focuses on people with profound and multiple learning disabilities and most of you know but maybe some of you don't those are people who have profound intellectual disabilities so very little access to cognitive capacity. They have multiple physical impairments. They often have co-occurring conditions like epilepsy and other things that make life challenging. And their lives are hugely important and it's, what is it, like half eleven at night now? And I bet if I went onto my Facebook I could pull up a profile, or I could find somebody online, I could find a mother online who has stood in an accident in an emergency unit and screamed for her child to be resuscitated. Because that happens, and I could take you to see any number of people who are just parked in their care home, sitting out the rest of their existence with nothing to do, because people don't know what they could do, or how to do it, or they don't have the time, and they're not, because it's not valued, because they're not valued, and so these lives are full of all these very important things, and what you learn is that the daft stuff matters. <laughs> Tinsel really, really matters. I, I got here. here you go. Look, let's see. Amongst the um, mess of the house, ridiculous tinsel. Because those moments, amongst the madness, that are filled with laughter and silly clothes and tinsel and fairy lights and things that don't demand to be screamed at, things that you don't have to fight for. Those are the moments where we're living. And if you feel like you're drowning, those are the moments to cling to. 